So what is up YouTubers, John Z here, and welcome back to the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Tournament Season 3, Part 3. So, um, this is the third tournament, and we will pick who will have the third spot in the final tournament. So we have uh, quite a bit of characters here today, so uh, let's see how they all do. So uh, first off, we have Diddy versus Mennonites. So let's see how this turns out. So if you guys know the rules, um, it's a three stock four minute battle with uh, battle, or Smash Ball and Stage Morph on. And that's practically it. So, yeah. Three, two, one, so, this is an interesting stage to start off. Alright, Mennonite gets the first hit. Ooh. Diddy doing some work right now. Oh my god! Diddy already taking out a stock from Mennonite! Holy crap! I mean, I've heard that, I mean, you guys remember how close the match was with Diddy and Yoshi. Did, I'm thinking Diddy might have, I mean, I've heard he's trained in the mountains. He's definitely trained in there. Getting ready. Ooh. Alright, ooh. Nice parry there by Diddy. And Diddy just knows. Jesus! Diddy's just out of nowhere and just knocking Man Knight out of. Like, jeez. Diddy, like, almost three stocking him right now. As the stage morph is. Well, I mean, he can't really. throw him off stage. Because now, now it's not a flat stage. Or, you know, a walk off stage sort of thing. But now we go between timelines right here, so, uh, yeah. Alright, Diddy's doing amazing work. Oh my good golly gracious, Diddy! Where did this power come from? Jeez, Diddy must have been training in the mountains or something, because he just... Holy crap, he just three-stock Mennonite right there. With 32% Diddy, where did this power come from? Man, that, the training in the mountains must have went up. Jesus Christ. Wow, well, congratulations to Diddy. And uh, Meta Knight, I'm sorry, but uh, if you have not made it to the final tournament just yet, but don't feel threat, there'll probably be other times. But anyways, we move on to the next round. We have uh, Pichu versus Young Link. Now, uh, these two kind of have history because they're the only two that have only shown up in Melee and then Ultimate. Everyone else has at least been in Brawl or Smash 4. So, you know. Like, everyone who has been from Melee has been in Brawl or Smash 4. So, you know. Interested to see that. Ooh. Don't know why Pichu let that happen. Um, Pichu, better be careful of what you can do. Oh, and Young Link's just... Smashing. Oh, Flying Man's around. I wonder if anybody's gonna... Okay, guys, what are you doing? You're just looking at each other. Oh, and looks like Pichu has gotten him. Damn. Okay. I mean, with Flying Man being on Pichu's side... Damn. Alright, Young Link's now down to... He's now down to... Two stocks now. Ooh. Big hit. Oh man. Flying man. It's just all flying man at this point. Peach is just flying around like nothing. Oh. They're both really coming close off stage. And that's an SD right there. Flying Man's not even giving room for Young Link to do some damage. Oh wow, that was an amazing combo right there. Pichu's definitely doing some work. Oh my god. He's almost three stocking as well. There's another Smash Ball. Alrighty. Oh man, is this it for Young Link? 
Jeez, we just have another three stock right now. Jeez. Man, is it just good characters versus bad characters at this point? Like, what the hell? Not, like, I'm not even... I'm not even saying Young Link's even a bad character. It's just, I guess, he's bad against... Pichu. Man. Well, Pichu, congratulations on making it to the next round. Uh, Young Link, I'm sorry that uh, you lost that round. But anyways, we move on to Mario going up against uh, Wii Fit Trainer. So we'll see how this fight turns out. Now, Wii Fit Trainer has never really made it into the final tournaments before. Mario has. So this will be an interesting fight. And, but the thing is, Mario has only entered Season 1. He hasn't made it in Season 2 before. So we'll see how this turns out. Oh. Mario looked like he was doing trying to do something sneaky, but unfortunately it did not work out in his favor. Damn. Ooh! Nice hit for Wii Fit Trainer. Ooh, that was a big spike. Good shield from Mario, you know. Ooh, fireball. And the soccer ball missed. Mario's trying to make sure uh, Wii Fit does not injure him. If that makes any sense. Ooh, a big hit. Oh, Mario was trying to go for the big hit. Damn. Oh. Ooh. I thought that was going to carry Mario right up top stage. At least this match has actually looked like it's getting a little closer. And um, Mario is now down to two stocks now. I thought uh, we <laughs> we Fit Trainer was going to SD. Oh, and Mario has Final Smash. Can he even the game up? I'll say that's a yes. As we Fit Trainer is now down to two stocks as well, both even. Damn. Mario just got like out of there. Now we're switching stages. Back, I think? No, we have not been here yet. So we're back at Picto Chat. Now, two minutes left, and we still have two stocks for both characters. Both at low percentage. Owie. Damn. So many Pac Mans. And he's not, he hasn't even been in any of the tournaments yet. And he's already making his appearance. Ooh, looks like Mario's doing some work now. Ooh. Okay. Ooh, almost a hit there. With a minute left. See how this goes on. Okay, that was a nice throw, but apparently the clock's gonna be in the way. With 45 seconds left. This could be Mario's if he knocks Wii Fit Trainer off his stock. Or else it goes to sudden death. And if uh, Wii Fit can actually also get another stock, and. They both just got stomped by shoes. Now they're both down to one stock each. Now can this final smash help uh, we fit out? Nope. It's not practically both even at this point. This is going to sudden death right now. And that's time right there, sudden death going on. And we fit just spiking Mario out of existence.
man, I'm sorry, Mario, but uh, apparently we fit showed you otherwise. I, mean, I guess she showed that she's more fit than you. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, shut up now. But, um, sorry to Mario for not making it into the, the final tournament just yet. But, you know, we've a trainer. You have that chance. You have that chance. Anyways, moving on to the next and last round of this, uh, first round. The last match of this first round, I guess I should say. We have Bowser Jr. going up against Villager. Now, I think both of these guys have made it into the final tournament before, but in different seasons. Bowser Jr. was definitely second season, and I believe Villager made it in the first season. I don't think he made it in season two. I can quickly check that while we're waiting. And we're here on battles, Battlefield. Good stage, good stage. Nice rocket right there. Uh, let's see. Season 1, yeah. Oh wait, no, he made it in Season 2. Never mind. So anything, Villager has the advantage, and by the looks of it, on this match, it looks like he does still have an advantage. I mean, Bowser Jr. kind of lost in this kind of rule set last time, so I don't know how things are going to be like this time. Bowser Jr. trying, trying his best. I mean, we all know why Bowser Jr. is here. He wants to join his pops in the champions bracket. Oh, and Bowser Jr. is actually the one that knocks off a stock first. Surprisingly, out of nowhere. Ow. Oh, and Bowser Jr. has Final Smash and uses it right away. If anything, uh, Bowser Jr. has a huge advantage with Final Smash at the moment, and bringing Villager down to two or one stock now. Are we gonna have like another three stock? Because most of these have been three stocks. Oh, we're here at the Unova League. I think it's the Unova League. Yeah, it's the Unova League. Are we gonna have like another three stock maybe? I mean, I don't know. Bowser Jr. looks like he's about to be finished. You remember the first two rounds, D just demolished Meta Knight, and then Pichu also destroyed Young Link. So we'll see if Bowser Jr. can destroy Villager. Ooh, well, that's not the case. But I still think Bowser Jr. has a huge advantage at this point. Still having two full stocks with Villager pretty much almost about to lose. But who knows, maybe Villager might pull something off right near the end. I mean, who can say? Who can say? Doo 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 doo. Oh, I mean, Villager's doing some work now. Good grab by Bowser Jr. Damn. Ow. That must have hurt. They both just kind of rolled there. Bong, bong. Oh, we're almost out of time, too. I think uh, Best Jr. is just going to win this by time, maybe. Is, is he going to just waste our time and just let... Or actually, we might go to sudden death if... Villager can knock off another stock before that time and survive. I mean, he pocketed that cannonball, so we'll see. Alright, he has Final Smash. Is this it? For Bowser Jr.? It is. Bowser Jr. has 10 seconds to knock out Villager, or else it's gonna go to sudden death, and Villager might use this to his advantage. And it's sudden death again. Jeez. Oh, 
Oh, unfortunately, Villager did not use it to his advantage, and Bowser Jr. has won the match. As we wait. So, congratulations to you, Bowser Jr., on making it into the next round. I'm sorry, Villager, that you're not made it in this, uh, this time yet, but, you know, there are still plenty of chances. This is only the third tournament. So anyways, with round one done, we move on to semifinals, as we have Diddy Kong versus uh, Pichu. And these, both of these guys three stocked last time, so we'll see how things go on this time. I mean, normally when uh, Diddy went up against Pikachu, Pikachu normally won, except the last time, which was off cam, uh, Diddy actually won against Pikachu the one time, so, you know, as we fight on Mementos... Ooh. Okay. Oh, Diddy, I don't know what you were thinking there for a second. Still, Diddy look like he's doing. Oh man, he's using the he's using the seal into his advantage right there. Do you see that? Oh my god. <laughs> what an amazing turnout right there. Jeez, Diddy, where did all this power come from? He's a power boy. Oh my good golly gracious! Pichu just spiked Diddy out of there. Oh my god. I mean, still, Diddy still has a bit of an advantage right now, but still, anything can happen. I mean, it really looked like Villager was going to win that one time against Bowser Jr. the last match, but, uh, things might be different in this case. As both of them are just jumping around. Oh, and Diddy just throwing Pichu right off stage. Oh, is Diddy about to go off stage? He rolled towards the blast zone, though. Oh, th threw a banana on him. Final smash. Pichu got this last time. Oh, and it's Pichu that has it! Ooh, and a miss! That, that was kind of bad for Pichu right there. And another spike! Jeez! I feel like the spikes are the only ways for Pichu to actually win this. Ooh. Was it enough? Ah, not enough to defeat. Oh, man, a big hit right there. The one thing I got, you guys gotta remember for Pichu is that, um... Oh, my goodness. That ball just kind of came out of nowhere. Pichu does self-harm to himself, so... Ooh. Diddy, you better not SD now, come on. You trained so hard. Ooh, it's getting close. I mean, against two players that actually... Oh my good golly gracious, Pichu's actually doing some work. One big hit from either one. Ew, and the spike! The spike is what happens. Dude, he's like, okay, you spike me twice, fine. I'll spike you. I'll spike you this time, and like that, Diddy makes it into the final round. Man, and he was after Smash Ball there too. Did you see that? Man, congratulations to Diddy. Oh man, you've definitely been training for these tough fights, haven't you? Well, I'm sorry to you, Pichu, but um, maybe in another tournament you will make it in. But for now, uh, Diddy makes it to the final round. And who will face Diddy? You may ask. Well, we have Wii Fit Trainer going up against Bowser Jr. And with their and with these two guys' matches last time, uh, they didn't three stock at all. They got completely even and went to sudden death. So we'll see how things turn out this time against Wii Fit Trainer and Bowser Jr. Three, two, one, go! 
Damn, Bowser Jr. is doing good to start off. Well, this is definitely going to be a hard stage to do direct contact, or at least knock off stage. Because, uh, you know, a pretty big stage. Ooh, good move for Bowser Jr. Damn. Okay. Not looking good for Wii Fit right now. But who knows? Maybe, maybe she can knock out Das Junior. Who knows? Oh. Well, so far they're at pretty much even percentage. This is probably gonna go to time for sure, because already we're almost well. We're already down a minute, and no one's lost a stock yet. Oh, Wii Fit is also still not dead after that big hit. Still not out! Wii Fit is going for the lower edge. Oh, and Wii Fit is the one that takes down a stock first. With only like two minutes pretty much remaining as well, we're almost down to like two stocks for both characters. If anything, this is definitely going to time. I don't know if it'll be sudden death again, but we'll see. <clears throat> I mean, also, now that I also remember, um, with stage morph on, um, it's gonna do this. So if they were on like the side of the map, oh, we go to one of our new maps, Spiral Mountain, which was uh, released with Banjo Kazooie being, like you know, Banjo brought one of his stages uh, to this tournament, so you know, him and Hero because they're new. The Sansa was like, yeah, maybe not this season. Now we move on back to this stage. All right, it looks like Bowser Jr. is not doing the best time. I just like how some of the stages are like, okay, we'll we'll appear for like a few seconds. Also, I didn't realize that um, We Fit actually had Smash Ball for a minute, but then lost it. And she's going for it. Well, she was, and Smash Ball is now gone. And right now, she's uh, practically winning the, at this point. This is definitely going to go to time, but who will knock out who before time runs out? Ooh! Ooh! Nasty! Nasty! For Bowser Jr. to win, he needs, he needs to take out a Wii Fit Trainer to one stock as well before 20 seconds is up. But alright, that's not looking so good for him right now. What were you doing? You should have grabbed! What were you thinking? This looks like it's Wii Fits. Oh, and like that, Wii Fit takes the match and moves on to the final round. Man, I'm sorry, Bowser Jr. You don't get to go to the final tournament yet, but, uh, you know, there's still plenty of tournaments. So, you know, stay tuned for those. Oh, excuse me. Alright, so now we head into the final round, which we have Diddy Kong facing off against Wii Fit Trainer. Oh, wait. Okay, there we go. I was wondering why I was not switching over to Nope. Because <laughs> we don't want to skip theirs. So let's see how things go with here. I mean, Diddy had an amazing battle last time. It was a pretty close one. Wii Fits wasn't so close, but you gotta remember, Wii Fits first round didn't three stock, but in fact, it was like a sudden death then. And uh, Diddy had a three stock in his first round, so we'll see how things turn off this time.
this is like a walk off stage too, so. Very risky if you go right off stage like that and Diddy, oh my good golly gracious, already knocking a stock from Wee Fit Trainer. Ooh. Getting hit with that banana. Oh, and getting spiked like that. Alright, good hit for Diddy. Another good hit for Diddy with that aerial. Oh, and getting hit with that soccer ball. Diddy's not used to sports. Because they never let him into the Olympic Games, which I hope he's in these next Olympic Games of Mario and Sonic. Ooh. Damn. Ooh, and trying to throw off stage wasn't enough though. Ooh, and Diddy's now down to two stocks now as well. Oh, damn. Uh oh, stage wharf. Diddy, Diddy. Oh, and, oh, oh, I thought we Fit had Final Smash for some reason. And here we are in Mario Kart, which is something Diddy's also not a part of. Can Diddy just get the Smash Ball already? No. And Smash Ball's gone. Ooh, and we Fit now down to one stock as well. I don't think the banana trick's gonna keep working now. Damn, and we're going back. Ooh. Ooh, I thought that could have been it. Ah, uh, not yet. Not yet. Refit's definitely doing some damage now, which kind of worries me. Because Diddy's made it this far. Oh, playing off stage, or just before off stage, it's not. It scares me. It scares me. <laughs> ah! Both pretty much even percentage right now. Looks like, I mean, Diddy still has an advantage, I know, like by a stock. But still, Refit Trainer could not die, and then Diddy could die, and... Wow, okay, that was like... That was almost like Explosion from Pokemon. Both sides lose, but like, um... Diddy having an extra stock made him win the match. Holy crap, Diddy has been definitely training in the mountains, I can tell. I mean, after that close game with Yoshi in one of the previous tournaments, and now this tournament won... He's definitely been training. So, uh, sorry, we fit, we fit trainer, but not this tournament. But hopefully, in another tournament, you can make an end. But for now, we have a winner. And of course, it's one of our boys as well. And like that, Diddy takes the third spot in the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Tournament Finals Tournament. So, so far, we have Hero, Sans, and Diddy. So stay tuned on who will make it in uh, next time. Because we're ending things here. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and tournament. If you guys liked it, press the like button or subscribe to Endeavor. And I'll see you dudes in the next video. See you dudes next time. Oh god, controls, controls! Controller, why?